Welcome to another edition of Get Victory. I'm Ed Crenshaw, pastor of Victory Church, Philadelphia, and we're honored that you have joined us for this moment of encouragement. You've been watching church sermons from other churches. Admit it. (laughs) It's okay. If we can benefit at all from the COVID-19 lockdown, it's that more of us are spending time going after God. Whether it be reading our Bibles more or watching online sermons, we have the ability to grow in our faith. And recently, while I was watching an online message, I heard a pastor who was not Pastor Ed, I heard him say, if you have stress, that means you're not trusting God. I was having a stressful day, so I didn't care for his viewpoint. See, in my head, I argued, I I trust God, but my problem is he isn't taking away my stress when I ask. And I've dealt with my fair share of stressful days, as most of us have. And on one of those particular days filled to the brim with stress, I turned to the Psalms for help. And this is what it says in Psalms 28, verse 7. The Lord is my strength and shield. I trust him with all my heart. He helps me and my heart is filled with joy. I burst out in songs of thanksgiving. I want us to notice a few things. First is that the psalmist does not say, my stress was washed away and then I sang songs of thanksgiving. He recognized who God is to him and praised him because of it in the middle of stressful moments. It's not that the stress will go away. Sometimes it does, but not often. But more about our response to the stress that counts. Don't miss this. Responding with thankfulness during times of stress puts us on notice to acknowledge God's help and presence in our lives. When we take the time to count our blessings, to remind ourselves of the ways, all of the ways that God has helped us through difficulties, through trials and tribulations, through even the little things, we are sure to experience his joy. And maybe that pastor had it right. When we remember to trust God and to face a hectic day with his strength in his strength, We'll see our blessings and count it all as joy. Let's pray. God, we thank you for being our strength and our shield. Guard us from dark mental places and give us the strength to walk in joy today. We know that you're in control and we love you. Amen. I trust this word has been a source of strength and comfort to you. During this trying time, Our church is bringing you these words every day, Tuesday through Saturday. Also, you can join us online for our live stream services on Sundays at 9.15 and 11.15 a.m. You can find the links to all the online resources to stay connected as God's family at getvictory.net. Until next time, let's stay in God's presence and peace.